Usman Dembele started the game at the Benito Villamarín on the left side. He was touching the ball calmly. When he didn't see things clear, the best option was to secure those passes in order not to lose the ball. It's difficult to steal the ball from the Frenchman, and we could see his skills after this backheel touch for Griezmann. He didn't mind if he had three Betis defenders in front of him. After dribbling them, turning around a few times, he was just dancing with the ball, and after having left them behind, he searched for the best option. He saw Jordi Alba's run, but that assist was too much. So Usman decided the next place should be easier ones. Touching the ball continuously, if something needed to be improved, he told his teammates. If he had to ask for the ball, he did so. If he had to help in defensive tasks, there he was, fighting every time and even recovering the ball. His teammates were searching for him once and again. He was offering himself, creating danger. In fact, he was the only one trying to do something different, like on this occasion with Pjanic. He got very upset with the referee after that corner kick wasn't given. Lenglet could have scored with a clear header here. Usman couldn't believe what his compatriot had missed. And take a look at this sprint when Busquets lost the ball. He's absolutely involved with the team and that's a new version of this player. If he lost the ball, he quickly fought to recover it and so he did. He was fighting everything, even if it was dangerous for his lower back. But the counter-attack from Betis ended in a goal. This was Dembele's reaction, very serious, looking down talking alone. He did seem annoyed. After that goal, he kept trying, he kept speeding things up, but his team wasn't helping. On the second half, he continued creating danger. After this personal play, he assisted Tumingueza and his shot ended in a corner kick. With Pedri on the pitch, the team was different, and Usman enjoyed his first shot on target after another personal play. Messi had been on the pitch for less than two minutes when he appeared on that right side. Usman gave the ball to Busquets, who passed it to Leo. The Argentinian played again with Dembélé, who after getting rid of Guardado, returned the ball to Messi and the captain scored. What a celebration by Usman! He lives the game with such passion lately. He kept asking for the ball and he kept giving instructions. He kept creating danger and he wanted more. And we could also see him protesting to the linesman. Hey, he pushed me there! On the next play, Dembele wanted revenge, but that revenge cost him a yellow card. He could have scored on this occasion, but that chance ended in a corner kick. The Frenchman regretted that one. Minutes later, Barcelona scored again, and Usman celebrated that one too. Messi knew how important Dembele was for this team. But after this free kick, Betty scored again, so Usman knew they had to keep attacking. Suddenly, he switched sides with Trincao, and that gave interesting results, because the Portuguese scored a wonderful goal from that right side. After the goal, we could see Barca players hugging again. Dembélé wanted to congratulate the Portuguese. Yes, Trincao, that goal was delicious. Dembélé played the last minutes on the left side until the referee blew his whistle. He was happy. He hugged his teammates, those who were on the pitch and those who were at the bench too. Barca achieved another victory. Victory, its players showed they're more united than ever, and Dembele proved again he's enjoying his best moment since he arrived to Barcelona.